day everyone. I am Aldea Nicole Tabak from ICT Linux and I am here to tell you the legend of Maria Makili written by Dr. Jose P. Rizal. Before we start, I will give you a brief background about the story. A legend is a genre of folklore that consists of a narrative featuring human actions perceived or believed both by teller and listeners to have taken place within human history. Maria Makiling is the guardian spirit of the mountain, responsible for protecting its bounty and thus is also a benefactor for the townspeople who depend on the mountain's resources. In addition to being a guardian of the mountain, some legends also identify Laguna de Bay and the fish caught from it as part of her domain. She was sent by Batala to aid the people of the area in their everyday life. So let us now proceed to the summary of the story. Long ago, in Mount Makiling, there lived the beautiful goddess named Maria Makiling. She is beautiful, kind-hearted, and loving. She had a long shiny black hair, and she often wore black pearls and gold jewelry. She often shows off herself to people living at the foot of the mountain as a human. Many times, people would climb up the mountain and pick up some fruits. But when they came down, fruits will turn into gold. But one day, some people wrapped her jewelry. Some hunters climbed up the mountain and hunted for wild animals, cut down trees, and left the forest at the top of the mountain denuded. At that time, one of those hunters is immortal, which Maria Makiling fell in love with. She discovered that the hunter already have a mortal as his wife. After those things happened, Maria Makiling was very angry that it thundered and rained hard that night and her voice was heard by all people living at the foot of the mountain saying I have provided you food, treasures, and shelter but it wasn't enough for you I have given you everything you want but still you are not contented I loved you more than myself but still you search for mortal love now feel my anger and wait for my revenge from now on, you shall stand on your own feet and you will never see me again, I swear. The moral lessons that we can get from the story of Maria Makili are we have to wait for the right time. We should not be in a hurry in our decisions in life, especially if it has undesirable outcomes. And we should avoid anger, grudge against others. That's all. Thank you.